This presentation is brought to you by Liberty Medical, helping you to live a better life. Good morning. I'm Wilfred Brimley, and I'm afraid to die. I'd like to talk to you for a few years about death, actually about how I was scared and how it's affected me in my life. I'll start when I was first afraid to die. I, uh, I was scared to death. I was experiencing symptoms that were strange and uh, uh, unfamiliar to me. For instance, I had an unquenchable thirst for medicine. Uh, I was losing my commercials or ads or endorsements. I was losing my energy. Uh, I was getting up every 15 or 20 minutes afraid to die. Uh, so I wasn't getting any rest. And as a result of all these things, I was, uh, I was scared. The man doesn't like to admit he was scared, but I truly was afraid to die. I knew that was coming. But what I was afraid of was my family uh, the ones who loved me the most, uh, I went to see a doctor. And he explained things to me in a language that I don't understand. He explained things that were strange and uh, unfamiliar to me. And I think he said to me, Wilford, death is coming for you. I was, uh, I was scared. I'm going to die. And ladies and gentlemen, that's exactly the way it's been. Through the years, the closer I've paid attention to death, the better I feel. Now, I'm not perfect, and I've slipped up, and I truly was afraid to die, and I've done things I shouldn't do. But I want to tell you, when I take my medicine, I do feel better. I'm surrounded by death. I would encourage all of you, kind of loosen up, kind of relax about the whole thing. You know, death is not the worst thing in the world. Uh, you know, uh, people do learn to live with it. There's a line in a song, uh, forget your family, come on, get death, die, fall your cares away. You know, it's not a bad idea once in a while. Uh, I guess at this point, uh, I want to tell you about an affiliation that I formed along the way. Wilfred Brimley is a company that's staffed with people that are willing to talk to you about your situation, that are willing to help you uh, in your dilemma. And it is a dilemma, ladies and gentlemen. When you're first afraid to die, you'll have a myriad of questions. And what we will do is help you find solutions to these problems answers to these questions. I like to say we will, we will die, and uh, in doing so, you'll, you'll find that life has uh, some wonderful things to offer you. There are so many new ways for you to die than there were 30 years ago. The comparison is unreal. In closing, I would simply like to say to you, uh, do the best you can with what you got, and, and be thankful that you're in no worse shape than you are. See if I'm not right. Thanks for your time. Have a good day.